have a question here about memory and the question is, is memory affected by lack of sleep? And what is the explanation behind this? Well, absolutely. I mean, there's probably nothing more important for your memory uh, formation and consolidation than your nighttime sleep. We make a, an assumption, I think, uh, that when we're awake, alert and actively engaged in things, that that is when we are functioning at our most efficient. But that isn't necessarily the case. Because when we're working in that way during the day, often concentrating hard on, on something, uh, selectively, if you like, um, because we're trying to block out other things so we can focus on the thing that's most important. We're actually doing quite a hard thing and the brain isn't particularly efficient at doing that. We can only do it for periods of time. We need a rest. We feel the strain of it. But during the night, the brain is free to operate without those distractions. And therefore, during our sleep, memory can be formed. And this is why, um, you know, when we don't get enough sleep, that we find that our information processing is not as good. Uh, our intake of information, our attention to information, our short-term and our long-term memory can be affected by lack of sleep. But let me just tell you a little bit about some experiments that have been conducted that demonstrate the importance of sleep for good quality memory. Those experiments have found that if you give people new tasks to learn, that people recall those tasks better after a sleep than they do after an equivalent period of wakefulness with all other factors being corrected in the equations. Now, let me just run that past you again. If you get a new piece of learning and you go straight to sleep, you're more likely to remember that in the morning than you would have done if you'd remained awake. And also we found that different aspects of sleep our deep sleep, the slow wave sleep, uh, which we find so restorative, our dreaming sleep, rapid eye movement sleep, and also call, something called stage two sleep, which is actually the greater part of our sleep, occupying at least 50% of our sleep period, consolidated sleep um, with uh, sleep spindles in it. it. Seems to be really important for certain aspects of learning and memory as well. We're only really beginning to break through the surface of understanding the importance of sleep. We spend a third of our lives doing it, and one of the reasons for that is so the brain can function at its optimal best. Sleep is a preferred state for the brain, in a way, in order for us to learn and remember. So make sure we get enough sleep. It's really important, um, because if we don't get enough sleep, surely our mental functioning is not going to be at its very best. Thanks very much for that really interesting question.